Hey guys, Railfaner200 here, and I think a lot of people will know that it's a little early for Halloween, but I just wanted to make this video to talk about a few things for this Halloween season that will be happening on my channel with my and with my haunted house. So, as you can see here, I did some marking for my haunted house. And I am starting to build the theme in the front here. It won't look like this. It'll look very different, very scary and stuff. But, let's see, here it is. It's got a tree here. And it also has a tree over there. Um... But guys, this year's themes at my haunted house are this front theme right here is named For Rent. For Rent. It is supposed to be a rental home that no one wanted anymore. You know, that no one wanted to rent. So now it's pretty much like possess. So right here, I'm getting, is going my animatronic. I'm getting this here, which I'll talk about in a minute. Right there is going the posable skeleton. In here is going my rising reaper. In here is going my shaking reaper. And each of these will be like strobe lights and spider webs in the background. And strobe lights, spider webs, and I'll put creepy flooring and background in. Here is going the jumping spider, my black jumping spider. And here is going my favorite little skelly bones. He'll be hanging out down from here and swinging back and forth. Um, so, and then my second theme, which is going over here, my second theme is an asylum, and it's named Insane Asylum. So, basically, I'm having a big entranceway, which I've marked here, a big, a big entranceway with gates and stuff. One side of the gate will be the brown jumping spider, and the other side will be some sort of prop, like guarding the gate. So then you have your pathway in. And then all back here, you'll have jail cells. In the first jail cell goes Dead Humor, which he's a part in out of there, he is. Dead Humor, my first Spirit and Halloween animatronic. In the second uh, cell will go my Skeleton Vampire animatronic from CBS, which uh, there he is back there. He talks and moves his head. He's seven feet tall. In the third cell will go a cage skeleton animatronic I have, and in the other cell will go another cage skeleton animatronic I have. And then on this side, um and this side actually is a posable skeleton. And then on the front display is a pop-up zombie right there. So yeah, a lot of animatronics in here. It's an insane asylum. See, here are all my animatronics back here. Kind of in storage. So, collection. Two jumping spiders. One, two, brown, black. Rising Reaper. Little skelly bones. Pop-up zombie. Two posable skeletons. Dead humor. Him, and then I have some other animatronics that are packed away. Um, but guys, something exciting is going to happen next week. Next week, I so I live in Buffalo. I have a Blaze Doll store nearby me, but they do they do not have the full display, and they so we travel to the Erie, Pennsylvania store, which last year was pretty small, so it wasn't really worth the trip, the an hour and a half trip. This year we went by going to an amusement park, Waldemere. And this year, it, it wasn't open yet, otherwise we probably would have stopped. It opened yesterday. But this year, guys, that store is huge. So this year, we definitely got to go down there. And this year, um, I already I have the money for my animated prop, my Spirit Halloween animatronic I'll be getting this year. And, and uh, my grandma said I have an investment of $100. So I'm either going to get so if I stay at that investment of a hundred dollars which usually she'll add some 
money on, which you probably end up will do, be doing. But um, if I stay at the hundred dollar budget, I will be getting. I think I'm leaning towards getting the Escape from the Grave animatronic from last year, 2016. If I don't, if I uh, go up a little, I'm either gonna get the electric electrified corpse or the smoldering zombie groundbreaker. If I do go up, uh, I would probably get the electrified corpse. You know, it would be cool to have him in the asylum Haney. So, that's all I wanted to say, guys. Um, look for a pro some animatronic reviews next week and include, especially the one I'll be getting, especially the one I'll be getting Tuesday, it should be and look for some videos of the Spirit Halloween, uh, Spirit Halloween 2017 sto in-store experience next week. Uh, now, this will probably be my only Halloween video for, like, a little while other than the reviews, but once I get into September and stuff, my haunted house is built, I'll have plenty of them. And Spirit in-store experiences, because I'll be traveling to some Spirit stores, not only down here, but Erie and some, uh, other Buffalo local stores that have a full display. So guys, happy early Halloween and stay tuned to my channel for more videos and thanks for watching.